<coughs> Four and a half years ago, here stood a person to break the ice, to speak about himself, and to start a journey, the journey of his master. He did not know at the time what's there in offering in the journey. He did not know at the time what he's destined for. But he knew one thing. He is going to enjoy the journey. Today, once again, the same person is in front of you to start, rather to say, restart the journey. I do not know what's there in the offering in pathways. I do not know what I am destined for in this journey that I have started, but I am sure I am going to enjoy it. Another common thing is, I have realized the butterflies, those were there in that stomach on that particular day, have yet not died. <laughs> <laughs> but I say, the chakra mein bhati hai, shayad usi ka naam to jindagi hai. The one that flows in cycle is life. And here, I am going to take my leap into the another cycle. Since it's an icebreaker and I have to introduce myself, I'll keep my introduction really brief. And my introduction is, I'm an engineering and management graduate by education, an ERP and CRM consultant by occupation and a program manager, project manager, or a solution manager by experience. That's my journey of the world. But to come to this place, from the point where I started my journey, my journey started from the land of Uttar and Ashoka, to the point where I'm standing today in the Silicon Valley of India. I have been through a lot of education, learning, and experience. My school journey <coughs> happened in Purnia and most part of it in Navodaya Vidyalaya Purnia. Education took me to Odisha, the land of steel, Raukila, where I did my graduation in, in engineering. In the, I graduated in electronics and automation engineering from NIT Raukila. Then I moved to IMT Gajiawa to complete my MBA. And then the corporate journey started. I went through various learning and experience through these, these years. One thing that I have noticed throughout I've never uttered a single number. Was the moment I give the number, it gives my age. <laughs> <laughs> and I promised myself that I'll be 18 till I die. <laughs> so those numbers do not matter. The number of experience don't matter. What matters is the experience itself. And beyond my corporate, my work journey, there are a lot of interests that I have, a lot of hobbies that I pursue, a lot of activities that I do, which makes my life livable. I enjoy poetry. I'm a poet myself. I write poetry. And more, many of them have been published on my website. The website is prashantkasing.com. Please go there and leave your comments if you like them, like my writings, if you like my poetry, or if you don't like it. It's an easy platform to get certain journey to certain input to my website. Please come there. Beyond poetry, I love trekking. I've been to places which I could never think of. The places dreams are made of. The highest that I have trekked is 14,100 feet, a place where vegetation stops. I've spent night in the valley where Kanchanjanga was there in front of me. Just the glimpse of Panchanjanga, just the feeling of being in the lap of Panchanjanga was good enough to endure minus 15 degree temperature. When I completed that journey, 
when I came back to the land, to the plain, I was tired, exhausted, spent. But I knew one thing. After having done that, I can do anything. Nothing is impossible now. And I proved it to myself. Before I started my journey, it was difficult for me to run 400 meters. But the same year that I completed that journey of trekking, I came back and completed half marathon. This is 21 kilometers. And within a year, I completed full marathon, 42 kilometers. And all these I've learned really impossible is nothing. You can do whatever you want to do. I had the same impossible kind of feeling when I started my Toastmaster journey four and a half years ago. I never thought I would sustain 10 speeches. But I completed 40 speeches in 43 months. And I got the fortune to be the first DTM from this club. I really enjoyed the journey. I look forward to a similar journey once again. Thank you.